by way of legislation to back up the activities of this uh, ecological fund and equally uh, sanitize and sensitize the way and manner this ecological fund has been utilized. Over time, this uh, fund was being used and the releases are becoming almost 100%. But the efficacy is significant. Normally, it doesn't commiserate with the releases. And uh, this committee, it is our sole responsibility to make sure that uh, whatever we are going to do, that equity must be respected. Because in any part of the country, today, the ecological problem is what about greatest challenge. Even today, there was a motion regarding to Green World, which uh, whether you are from the north or you are from the south, <coughs> this thing is affecting all of us. Honorable members, uh, I want to align myself with um, the two last speakers to say that I also front load my commitment to this committee. Chairman, I know you, I know I met you here in the Eighth Assembly, and you are a very senior member of this house, so I know that um, you're going to work. Um, this committee is a very sensitive one because many of um, people who ought, who ought to benefit from it by way of um, uh, whom are affected are not benefiting from it before now. In fact, I, if you ask me, I want to say that it is a pipe. So now having you in the ends of our affairs here, leading us in the committee, I want to believe that you will change the narrative like you just said. I'm the chairman of um, Ask on Environment, so I will include it with you as well. But I want you to be very firm. When I mean very firm, because I know this collegial committee is like a pipe. So once you are here, what you need to help us is to help us stop the pipe from flowing so that we can really use it for the reason for why it is meant. Thank you.